All right, uh, Jim Overton again here with Force and Coffee Talk, Greyhound 1972. But we have Mr. Davenport here. He used to be one of the band directors here. So how important, and I saw you doing a grand reunion, and you did a pretty good job of humming the knock and rock, so. <laughs> but uh, you had to do what you had to do that night, right? They didn't have it ready, I had to go ahead and put it out. Yeah, but you know, it's amazing, everybody chimed in, you know. We never forget that. So how is it important, is it, I know you come back as often as you can. Well, as a, as a North graduate myself, class of 1980. Okay, 1980. It was double important for me. Right, so I that was really important real special coming back here and being the band director so what year was it when you came back in the family? I came back as band director in 1985 1985 graduated in 80 and came back in 85 as band director. well it didn't take long did it nope. <laughs> so how long were you the band director in the year? I stayed as band director for 10 years oh okay that's yeah, so you got a nice little span years. there so so many of my students are out here so it's good to come back yeah I, I heard your name you know uh, when I talked to Norfolk students that were in the band mm -hmm. you know my era was Mr. Fields. Right. You know, and I wasn't in the band, but, you know, we all knew him. Right. And uh, He was a dear friend of mine, so I tried to carry on the legacy. Like, yeah, we appreciate it. And we, uh, on our little podcast, we were lucky to get uh, a nice hour-long interview with him. Okay. You know, so I'm glad we got it a year before he uh, passed away. So. But anyway, thanks for talking to us, and I uh, appreciate you. Glad to have happy homecoming. Thank you. Same to you, and thanks for continuing that legacy. Once you well, got out of here. Glad I could do it. All right. Appreciate you, brother. Take, Take care. Bye-bye.